If you like to play the objective in Modern Warfare 2, then you've no doubt experienced the blinding effects of tactical grenade spam. Fortunately, the battle-hardened perk provides resistance to tactical equipment, and since it's a basic perk, it'll be in effect for the entire game. But resistance isn't exactly immunity. In today's video, we'll jump into a private match and see exactly how much resistance Battle Hardened provides against every tactical grenade in Modern Warfare 2. The in-game description tells us that the Battle Hardened perk will reduce the effect of enemy flash, stun, EMP, gas grenades, and shock sticks, and provide immunity to snapshot grenades. We'll begin by analyzing what's probably the most popular tactical, the flash grenade, which causes a blinding and deafening effect which lasts for a full two seconds. Battle Hardened offers partial immunity and will reduce the duration of the effect by 65%. Next up, the stun grenade, which has a strong effect on mobility, reducing movement speed and the ability to adjust point of aim for a duration of about two seconds. Battle Hardened will reduce the duration of the stun effect by 50%. The gas grenade functions similar to a stun, restricting movement speed and causing a momentary coughing effect. However, it will have no effect on the ability to adjust point of aim. The gas grenade also has a longer lasting area of effect, making it well suited for restricting access to corridors or small rooms. Battle Hardened only offers minimal resistance to the gas grenade and will eliminate the coughing animation and will allow you to move slightly faster while maneuvering within the gas cloud. The shock stick will stick to surfaces and will remain active for a few seconds or until encountered by an enemy. It produces an electrifying effect causing muscle contractions in the victim, forcing them to hip fire their weapon in an uncontrollable spray pattern. Interestingly, the Battle Hardened perk has no benefit against the shock stick, and the duration of effect is identical with and without Battle Hardened equipped. The effects of the remaining tacticals are best demonstrated by observing two enemies side by side, one with Battle Hardened equipped and one without. The snapshot grenade highlights enemies through walls for a short duration and displays this information for your entire team. Battle Hardened functions exactly as stated in the description and offers full immunity to the snapshot grenade. Battle Hardened has no effect on any of the remaining pieces of tactical equipment. The heartbeat sensor, the spotter scope, as well as the decoy grenade all function exactly the same regardless of whether or not Battle Hardened is equipped. To be completely thorough, we need to address the in-game description which mentions that Battle Hardened reduces the effects of EMP. And since there currently isn't an EMP grenade in the game, we can only assume this is a reference to the DDoS field upgrade, which disables enemy electronics. However, Battle Hardened appears to have no noticeable benefit against the DDoS's electrical interference effect. Battle Hardened is no doubt a super popular perk, and even though it doesn't offer 100% protection, it's a perfect choice for the aggressive, objective-oriented player. And since we have two slots available in the basic perk category, pairing it with Bomb Squad for lethal grenade resistance will give you the best possible chance to stay alive and earn the higher level streaks. Of course, this is all just my opinion, and I'd like to hear from you guys. Is Battle Hardened effective enough as is, or does it need a change? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one.